just went shopping and we didn't mean to. What? She said, come and buy a shrimp now. Cynthia's 30th birthday party. Put your hand on your hip. Right. Yes. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, see your large here, future large eight to be exact. What's going on, honey? So, how you feel? Where we going? Okay, we about to read the scripture of the day. It comes from Second Corinthians chapter nine, verse eight, and it says, "And God is able to make all grace abound to you, so that always having all sufficiency in everything, you may have an abundance for every good deed." Amen. I don't think I've ever heard that scripture before, but of course, you know, it's not all about good deeds. <laughs> You gotta have a good heart too. So don't take that scripture and run with it talking about all I gotta do is be good and I'm gonna get this. <laughs> no. Anyway, so um, I'm here and listen, I know that some of you might be upset because the vlogs are so behind. Trust me, I get it. I'm upset too. It's a little embarrassing but like I'm trying to figure out why people are upset because when you watch reality TV, what you watched last night happened like seven months ago and those people have a whole crew. Guys, it's just me. Solo me. That's it. I'm the one who has to be doing all this editing and all this stuff like that. But I'm trying. I'm really trying. We're almost on December if it helps you feel any better. But uh, I just wanted to talk a little bit about this vlog because I did not do an intro. I was invited to do a wedding show at the Connecticut Post Mall. And uh, I went with the whole family, you know, Jatozawe, and Larik and Charles. And uh, I had my little display set up, but then I realized we didn't have to stay there. So we just hung out at the mall. You guys ever watch the, the Christmas movie with Will Ferrell? It's called Santa? D Dear Santa? I can't remember. It's something. I'll put it on the screen. But it's a really funny movie. It's actually one of my favorite Christmas movies. And so um, there were some people dressed up like the characters from the movie. And Jaden and Jonathan, they weren't really feeling it. You would? <laughs> Let's see if you recognize this one. <laughs> you know, Jack Serving, Jack Serving, Grand Serving, Nixon, John Living, Cute and John Living, Nixon, but do you the most famous reindeer of all? You got You guys want some Reese's? <laughs> you want one, girl? Thank you. So then after that whole debacle, we decided to go Black Friday shopping, which I did not mean to do. Like, I was like, I'm not going to do this. I don't ever really participate in Black Friday shopping. Like, it's just not something I do because I think it's whack. And I'm, I'm not like a materialistic person like that. I like to have nice clothes that I rent and I like to have nice photography gear. But to go like blow $500 on the TV, for why? So, you know, we just decided to buy some clothes because that's all you got to do, right? We just went shopping and we didn't mean to. Like, I kept saying, yeah, I'm not going to go Black Friday shopping. But then I was like, wait a second, the boys need new jackets. And my feet were killing me in my heels. Because, you know, I'm dressed up for the expo. So I ended up buying these slides at Macy's because my feet hurt. And everybody's looking at me like I'm crazy because I'm dressed up really nice from head to ankle. And then I got these mad ghetto slides on. But anyway, um, I think we're going to go to Cracker Barrel now. We just came from Express. Rudy got himself some cute stuff. Yeah. Uh, he, got, he got two shirts and some black pants and that man's gonna be looking fly tonight i gotta make sure i get home in time to wash my hair and i gotta go to the post office lord then after that we went to cracker barrel ate some food and our waiter reminded me so much of one of my ex-boyfriends he had the same name as him the same eyes he was a little bit better looking though a little bit but i was just like i was looking at him like 
tell you so. <laughs> but yeah, we ate and we had a good time. We are at Cracker Barrel now. It was a half hour wait or a 40 minute wait or something like that. But we made it inside and we're about to pick our food. I'm gonna order breakfast. I don't know what Larry is ordering. Um, Okay, that's a that's a start. I mean breakfast. It's for the boys. Definitely. I always do breakfast. That's all I get here. I don't even want to see the dinner menu. I want breakfast. What? She said cut your fire shrimp now. Wait a minute. Okay, we'll do both. Breakfast and dinner. I'll take I'll take the breakfast to go and have it tomorrow morning or something. Yeah. Carrots, yeah. Thank you. Oh wait, the kids the kids' food only comes with carrots? Yumma. Yumma. Yumma, yes, thank you. Yumma. So after Cracker Barrel, we went home and we had to change and all this stuff and we had to get ready for Cynthia's 30th birthday party, which was so exciting because my girl Zamanique was going to be there and Vanessa was going to be there, you know, we will have a good time and it was so much fun. So I miraculously made it to the hair salon and got my hair done, which is great because I really needed my hair to be washed. So Rudy and I are currently walking into the Marriott for Cynthia's 30th birthday party. Rudy, are you excited? Yeah. I'm excited to be out. Haven't been out in a little bit. Uh, and then tomorrow is Friendsgiving, so this week has just been jam packed with events. That's great. Welcome to the next day! Again, no introduction whatsoever. So I don't remember what happened during the day, but in the evening, oh, I had a whole photo shoot. Did I not include that in the vlog? Hold on, let me show you some clips from that photo shoot. Now I can show you what happened at the Friendsgiving. I love this Friendsgiving so much. It's the second one that I've ever been to uh, that Vanessa hosted and it was so much fun. Uh, we played a bunch of games. I remember last year Rudy and I were the ones who introduced the games to them and then this year it was like automatic games. Like we played so many games. 
It was so awesome. <laughs> you want to hey, 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 hey. oh, oh, hey. Yes. Oh, no. And then one of the girls, her boyfriend, surprised her with like a cake and really nice gifts. <laughs> But it was still really sweet, and he got her some nice gifts. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna front. After that, we played some more games, and Rudy and I are very competitive, both of us. I can't even say him, like, we're both very competitive, and we might have made fools of ourselves, but I don't care, no me importa. No, no, no. Video games. Cow, cow. Guitar. Oh, violin. Yes? I'm really tired. It's an afternoon. Fatigue. Yeah, yeah, but oh. what, what do people do when they're super tired? They take a nap. 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 Come on, Vanessa. I believe you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my brain comes to my brain. Oh. Okay, whoa. Cheese. That's it? Yeah. Okay. Alright, so this one. What was it? Oh, uh, oh that was clown. Oh, he got two. How? Because Steve gave up. Jeffrey, what you said? You got a lot of clown? Wait, hold on. What? Oh, God. <laughs> Action. Character. You gotta be fired. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, you, Yo, the do you understand how this game 
it works. Sir. Okay, Jeffrey, I need you to be quiet for a little bit. No, we, we got, no. Jeffrey, we don't let the other chat. So that was our Friday and Saturday after Thanksgiving, and it was great. Like, I'm just so happy that, you know, even though the vlogs are two months behind, I'm so happy that I have these memories because honestly, I probably would never remember anything. My memory is so bad, and it's just nice to be able to look back on stuff and see what we did, and it's a very nice feeling. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this vlog. Listen, I'm going to be traveling next week, so there are definitely not going to be any vlogs. Maybe I'll post one or two, you know what I'm saying. I'm going to be traveling next week. If you want to know where I'm going, you have to follow me on Instagram, at least. At Mama Larje. If you don't have Instagram, we have Facebook. At Larianne and Rudy. Or I think it's Rudy and 7911. I don't remember. Facebook.com slash Rudy and 7911. Or search up Larianne and Rudy on Facebook. You know, because we post all of our stories there and pictures and stuff. You guys... This year is going to be a year full of traveling, okay? And I want to take you along on the journey, but I don't want you to be upset because I post about it two months later. <laughs> I'm a busy girl, you know what I'm saying? Listen, just follow me on the social medium and do what you gotta do, girl. But you can watch this stuff live as it happens. If you're not watching it, that's your fault. I don't know why I'm talking like this today. Well, I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Now, of course, we gotta wait because these people never want to put the whole script on there. Let's switch that to NASB, por favor. Gracias. Rudy and I are very competitive. Com